is you feeling me? If not, you feel my energy. See, I know I'ma make it, but even if I don't, don't feel bad. Cause honestly, all these times that I had, those will be the best memories. Alright, so here we go guys. I'm so nervous right now to see what pick we get. A top 10 pick would be so beautiful. Yes. Come on. Uh oh. Hold on. Okay, 14. I will take 14. I will take 14. That's nice. We're a lottery pick. I like to see that. And we got uh we got some fire coming at you guys in the top five right there. And oh my god, this is gonna be nerve wracking. This pick 14 is 14 is an interesting pick. We're gonna be in the middle of the draft for the most of the time. But ooh, I was I was eyeing Dwight too. He was a guy that I probably wanted to go after, but they'll snag Kyrie at 12. And who they they snagged Mello. Oh my god, I am so between these two right now. Oh, the first overall pick right now. Not first overall, first round pick. We can go after anybody. We're not restricted by who we need at certain positions. Um, Paul George is a year younger. Ugh, that's not going to play that big of a role. Both of them have huge salaries. That's not going to play as much of a role. Kawhi's got a, a low salary, but he's got one year left on his deal. I'm liking the fact that Paul George has four years left. I feel like Paul George, everybody gets him though. You know what I mean? I feel like he's been in every My GM series from like everybody else. I'm going with Blake Griffin in our first pick. I'm feeling Blake Griffin for our first pick. And let's see, where's Johnny getting picked? I want to see where John Wall gets picked. I'm calling. He's going to go 18th. Watch this. Oh, now he'll go 19th. Okay. Um, Pistons line up getting Dame the GOAT. Oh, wow. Derrick Rose just went. And we got some options here. Um, oh, I feel like you guys don't want me to bring him back though. Not because you guys didn't like him, but I feel like you guys wouldn't want me to just bring back the same people. Um, what do we got here? We got Ron, we got Drew Holiday. That's not bad, man. I would bring in Kobe, but he's getting up there. Um, Kmart's out there. I like my odds with Rudy Gay. I'm not gonna lie. He's... He's up there for me right now. Valanchunas could be a huge asset. Draymond Green, we already had him though. I kind of want to run with Rudy Gay, but he's got that huge salary. That's killing me right now. Who's got a decently low salary? Valanchunas, he's got two years left. We're running with him. We got, you guys have been telling me, you guys have been saying, you've been saying TGTV, I want to see a big man dominated team. Here you go, man. We got the big man dominated team right now. And, um, oh my gosh, we've just got so many good big men out here right now. Oh my gosh, not Paul Pierce. Solinger, no way. Jamal Crawford, ugh, I'm not picking Jamal Crawford at this point in the draft. Um, no, we could go after Bobby Schmurda. I'm not gonna lie, he might not be a bad pickup right here. I'm not, I'm not picking Franklin the Turtles bum ass over here. Probably gonna stop playing for me. I'm trying to keep the salary low because I, I want to be able to work with contracts over the offseason. MC Dubs is down there. Um, who do we got shooting up? Wes Matthews, though. Wes Matthews, though. He could be somebody to go after. Um, I'm gonna go after Schmurda, though. <sighs> Alright. I'm, I'm liking our draft so far. I think we're doing a pretty decent job getting a good team right now and uh we gotta go after a small forward or shooting guard look at rondo's still there man rondo is still somehow there tony allen eh. shump did we have jr smith in a series oh why do i feel like we had jr did we like just have him or something i feel like we had him and i didn't like i i'm drawing such a blank right now avery bradley not a bad pick to go after Ooh, i might consider avery bradley right here avery bradley's 23 years old we got him on contract for a few years not a ridiculous contract either yeah he might be the move honestly 
I'm kind of liking my odds with Avery Bradley right now. Okay, here we go. Come on. Oh, Rondo finally got picked. I saw him in there. And the Lakers will pull the GOAT out of the draft right there. <laughs> um, come on. Ooh. I feel like this draft just got so much worse so fast. Uh, can we do team roster here? We gotta go after a small forward. Just kind of even out the starting lineup a little bit. Wilson Chandler. Trevor Ariza would be nice. Oh. Damari Carroll would be nice as well. We, of course, had Nick Young on the, uh, oh, my God, Minnesota Timberwolves series. Jay Crowder, he's been doing a fantastic job this season for the Celtics. I'm going to go with his brother, though, Damari Carroll, his dreads brother. Um, and TJ Warren gets picked right there. I'm just looking at who's getting picked. We're kind of we're in a scrub zone right here. Do we want to try to get some leadership in Kevin Durant? I feel like he's not the move this early, though. I feel like he could still drop a little bit. He's 38. He's got probably one season left in this. I feel like he's not the guy we want to pull out right now. Oh, we had Omar Sheik in the Nuggets series off the bench. I don't like that contract, though. I'm trying to be smart about this contract-wise. And who can we go after? I'm trying to see best in every position. Um, I I'll take Alex Len. My son's boy right there. And... Yeah, Brandon Wright got picked. I had a feeling Brandon Wright was getting picked pretty soon. Um, Garnett's still out there as the best player left. Jordan Clarkson as a backup shooting guard? Don't mind it at all. Give him a shot with us. If KG's still around, we're picking him right here. Oh, I, I just said that, but now I kind of want it. Uh, let's take him. Let's I he's that's an early pick I think but I want like a good I mean he can be older but I need somebody who can play well for us and we need that ability and that skill in our first season give the free agents a reason to come here you know what I mean um and oh we have a chance of bringing another older player here a lot of you guys are telling me you want to see me draft Vince Carter he's a guy that a ton of people were telling me to draft um no way I'm drafting Steve Nash I love Steve Nash death man but I'm not drafting a 40-year-old right now. I, I say that after I drafted a 38-year-old. Um, I want to see KG in that warrior. Oh, that looks pretty good. I'm not going to lie. Uh, Alex Len, Jordan Clarkson. So we got two point guards, two power forwards, two centers. We need another shooting guard. So another wing player is uh, what we're really looking for right here. Vince Carter could do that. I'm going to wait on Vince Carter, I think. Captain Kirk, no. I saw Justin Holiday and thought that was Drew Holiday and like, I don't even know what I was about to do. No, not Tabo Cephalosha. Oh, everyone's so old right now. Everyone is so old right now. And Marcus Thorne, CJ Miles, I've been playing with him in my career on the, uh, on the Indiana Pacers. So he might not be the bad pickup. I will pick Vince Carter if he's still around. Doesn't look like it. Looks like, oh no, he is still around. I'm taking Vince. Ah, uh, do I need to actually? No, you know what? Let, let's try to go after a good center right here. Let's go after Perk. Perk's got, uh, Perk's got a huge contract. Elton Brand's got a low one. Sean Marion's got a low one. Andrew Bynum's getting paid five million. Ugh. You know what? Hmm, no. I can't even push myself to do that. Nick Collison. He could be a decent rim protector, not gonna lie. And look at that, Timberwolves got Ray Allen right now. Wow. Going back to our series. And please tell me he's still there. We're taking him here. We're taking Vince Sanity in the draft. We're gonna be beastly with him. He'll be the new Splash. He'll, I don't know. Who else can Splash on this team? Who are going to be our Splash brothers? Avery Brad. Who's got the best threes on the team? Oh, God. Ugh. Jeez. We're going to need to do something to fix this. We are... Not a single Splash will be made. Oh, my God. We have literally no three-point shoot. Let's go after a dude with good three-point shooting in our... Um, are we on the clock right now? Is this a 12th round? This is it? 
Let's just sort by who has the best three out here. Luke Babbitt? Honestly, I'll take him. Um, we need a guy who's going to come off the bench and hopefully give us something. Or I guess mm, we have had Matt Simon. I want to as much as I want to. I can't. I can't go out and cheese with him again. I didn't really cheese with him either. I, was, I honestly wasn't that great with him. But um, this looks like this is the end of the draft. I'm pretty happy with our team right now. We came out with a pretty good draft. I think getting Blake Griffin in there was great. Um, oh, look at that. They're welcoming me. Win the division this series, period. Oh, God. Um, my... We, we don't know who's good. I was about to say, like, let me think about who's good in the Warriors division, but we don't know. Uh, make some moves, I'll guess, another first-round pick hard. I, I don't know if we're going after first-round picks here. Maybe. Um, team chemistry stay above. Might, I don't know. I'm not making any early trades because I do want to keep that up. Uh, oh, we can do that with Blake on our team. Yeah, definitely. Top 10 in attendance. If we're doing that, we're probably keeping top 10 in attendance. And this is the budget. Look at, we put a lot in the staff payroll. And I, I like that. I like that a lot. Make sure that we have the best guys on deck here. I'm happy to have Steve Kerr with us. That's going to be great, man. We got a great coach with us. Um... And we're going to download a draft class. Okay, guys. You guys are watching me. Embrace the pace right there. Right there. I I'm doing this one. I'm doing this one. I don't know how it keeps happening. But I always, always seem to pick the wrong one. So, guys, in case you were skipping around the video, just seeing which pick, 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 and you missed one of them, this is our team right now. I don't hate it. Look at our age. This is what I was going for. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven guys 25 or under, and we've only got three guys over 30. This is pretty good. I didn't even realize Nick Collison was this old either. Um, as for contracts, we got one, two, three, four, five guys who are going to have expiring contracts. That's not as good. Those are guys that we might need to deal by the end of the season. Um, we want to be able to keep guys here for multiple seasons, but I mean, we got a lot of guys that here are here for a good amount of seasons right now so um guys thank you for watching subscribe if you haven't hope you guys enjoyed this please make sure to leave a like on the video comment what you thought about the draft make sure to follow me on twitter at tgtv official tell me what you thought about everything and uh guys thank you that's it peace i'm out